Elizabeth Wagmeister here with Variety, and this week we are on the set of Disney Channel's hit show, Casey Undercover, to talk with Judy Taylor, who heads casting for Disney Channel. What? You never heard of a teenage spy? <laughs> Disney is such a powerhouse. The roster of talent that has come out of the Disney family is more than impressive. So is there a secret to really pinpointing talent when you're casting here at Disney? There are several things we, we look for. Um, first and foremost, acting ability. Because when you're trying to find someone who can truly anchor a series, that's a huge responsibility. Most of our programming is based in comedy. So we look for a sense of humor for someone that we think knows where the funny is, as we say. Probably the most elusive thing we look for is that indescribable thing. Some call it the it factor, but it's a certain presence where you can just tell they're comfortable, they're very natural in their acting, it's kind of an extension of who they are as people, and it seems effortless. When you meet these kids, they are legitimately children. I think you mentioned when you met Zendaya, she was just 11 years old. I'll never forget it. Bottom line, your music is terrible and you look like you should be on the cover of a hot chocolate box. <laughs> She was absolutely captivating when she walked in, even at 11. You know, it was my third Disney audition was, was Shake It Up, so I got it pretty fast, and I think that was because I went in there with my mindset and I knew what I wanted, and I was, you know, coming in there prepared and ready to go. I always say there are two things that happened for me that I know maybe I'm seeing somebody extra special. And the first is you don't want them to leave the room. And then the second thing is we videotape, of course, all the auditions. And when I find myself randomly going back and watching an audition and never really tiring of it, that's another very, very telling sign. You go in there with a lot of energy and just be yourself. Like that's the most important thing about Disney casting is they don't hire people to really play huge characters. Like I feel like everyone's character is somewhat like themselves. Let's say I actually wanted to go to this dance Friday night. What would I wear? Judy's a bomb. Mm -hmm. She really is. She's really, really cool. She has a way of seeing something in young people. You know, it's easy to see talent in an adult because they've been working at it forever, but for a young person, you, it's kind of like, are they going to be able to pull it off? Are they going to be able to do it? I know you like him. No, 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 no. I would never do that to you. Oh, no, but I want you to. Please take him back. <laughs> It was a great, I got a call back, my first audition. My That's first amazing. Time. Yeah, but I've been auditioning for Disney for a very long time. Mm -hmm. Well, like my abuela says, boys don't go for girls who kick their butt. Um, <laughs> your grandmother never said that. Yeah, but whenever I add like my abuela says, it always sounds convincing. <laughs> it was an amazing, scary, exciting, wonderful process because every time I was guest starring or co-starring, I was so excited to be there, but also looking at the regulars saying, you know, I just want to be there. And that's the beautiful thing about Disney and Judy is once they see you and they, they like you, they know that they're going to use you and they just wait for the right time. What does it feel like when you spot real talent? It's so exciting. I can still say after 40 years of doing this that there is nothing quite like that feeling when it just hits you right between the eyes. This is somebody extra special. I can tell you, for example, High School Musical. You just saw it happen right in front of your eyes. You always hope that it's crystal clear like that. When it's just so recognizable, that's when it's the best.